G'day guys, welcome to another edition of Locker Talk. Uh, this episode is sponsored by Bose, so we're going to be talking about music. Let's go find some boys. Got the great man Jack Frost. Um, this episode is sponsored by Bose, um, so we're talking about music. Yes. What is your least favourite song of all time? Um, it gets played a lot here in the gym, but Humble by Kendrick Lamar. Can't, Horrible. Can't stand it. I can't stand it. It gives me a headache. Everyone loves it, but not for me. I'm 100% with you. Around here, you actually end up liking songs and then they just get overplayed in the gym and then you end up hating those songs. So anything sort of that the boys play and repeat in the gym, so let it rock at the moment. Little Wayne, Kevin Rudolph, came out about 10 years ago and I just can't, it, I hate it. I have to leave every time I hear it. I reckon it'd have to be, you know the old like Crazy Frog? Back in the day, ding 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 ding. Yeah, like well, that used to get a massive run through primary school and that. Everyone used to play it, and I just couldn't handle it. Ron Harwood's a culprit for playing Eminem a lot. That's all he plays. So Eminem "Lose Yourself" is a terrible tune, Bundy. Yeah, oh, I'm with you. It's big, big. We're getting, we're getting a bit of criticism over the back of my shoulder here, but uh, oh, what do you reckon? That's not the worst song ever. Well, I reckon it's the worst. He asked me, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Which of the boys we play with has the best playlist, do you reckon? That's a tough one. Yours isn't bad. You've got some good tunes. Just because it's a bit of a mix-up, yeah. it's not your, not your everyday crap. I don't know, I reckon Belly sort of all-rounded, has a pretty good idea in most areas, so I'll, I'll give Belly a... There's a few different ones. Obviously, you've got your country boys. They like to play the old sort of... Sitting around a campfire sort of songs, um, and then you got guys like Matho and Keezy who just played real, real heavy like um, like rap music sort of stuff. That was that was horrible this morning. Yeah, it was. It was no good. Uh, oh, I don't mind Sam Mays. Uh, he plays a bit of old school sort of NXS that sort of stuff. Uh, you, thanks. I uh, I tend to like your type of music. Um, no one else at the club plays it, so. I would say you. Um, what's your game day pump up song? Um, I'm in charge of the Neeful tunes at the moment. so Important job and doing well at the moment. I appreciate the feedback. Um, no, uh, you saw, I just, I can't be bothered changing anymore so I just chuck on the playlist but anything really goes through like a whole different sort of thing. Whatever is sort of popular at the time the boys like so. I like sort of, um, oh, it's Vietnam War like era music I guess. Um, you Paint It Black by the Rolling Stones. Love that song. Um, also some Kanye West. I like Kanye West. Gets me in the mood. Um, bit of Monster featuring Nicki Minaj. So I've very two <laughs> random very two random mixes there but I like a bit of uh, Hellions fun. I know you you're a great fan a massive well. massive fan. Uh, so Hellions Thresher. That's a great tune. What a track. Yeah, 100% with you there, Bing. Gets the, that gets the juices flowing before a game. Um, not, not bad like Eminem so, sometimes, you know, just to sort of get you in that mood. Uh, even a bit of Kanye West. Um, yeah, nothing too extreme though. Whose voice, singing voice, talking voice, would you like to cancel out with your Bose noise cancelling headphones? Oh, it'd have to be TC, Tommy Cutler. What a horrible voice he has. <laughs> uh, not only when he speaks you know, generally, just every day speaking, his voice is annoying, but when he sings, you just want to whack the boasters on, mate, and you just block it out, you know? <laughs> it is terrible. I would like to cancel out Tom Cutler's voice. I can't stand it. All those stupid noises he makes. Are we talking about everyday voice or singing voice? Oh, both. We'll say singing and, and normal voice. I'm going to put two votes down for Tom Cutler. <laughs> can't have it. <laughs> it's got to be Eric Kipwood. His voice is no good when he sings and he doesn't know the words to any songs so he just sort of says one or two words and then just hums the rest and then he'll say a word that's just not anywhere near what it's supposed to be and because I live with him I get a fair bit of it so definitely Eric Kipple would. Uh, so obviously Alan you know I live with uh, Hugh McCluggage and um, he's got a guitar, obviously likes to play that a fair bit and every now and then he gets it out and sort of thinks that he can really rock the place and yeah so his voice is pretty average so if you wouldn't mind uh, getting these on and avoiding that that would be the best. That's it. Just because you can play guitar doesn't mean you can sing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I think a few boys at the club need to understand that. It, you're, not, you're not a singer, mate. You play your guitar, just keep quiet. 
<laughs> Thanks, mate. Both are running a competition for Lions members and fans for an exclusive match day experience and to win one of these pairs of Bose headphones. Keep an eye on the website from Monday for your chance to win.